because I want to spend the rest of my life with Jessica. Not long after we started dating, I just realized she completes me and makes me happy and there's nobody else I'd rather be with. Uh, I planned it for probably about a month or two before my birthday. I started getting everybody on my side, letting me know every detail, so I was always one step ahead and taking over, planned on taking over my birthday to make it all about her instead of about me. And I had a lot of her friends on my side helping me figure out what kind of ring she liked and having uh, somebody go with me and help me pick it out and making sure it was perfect for her. I was nervous pretty much my whole birthday, starting from the second I woke up. Uh, I had my managers on my side, having her work when she didn't have to so I could get stuff done. Um, pretty much nervous, just wanted the moment to come, but I knew we had a whole day to go. The entire day, I'm talking to people, trying to hide my phone, didn't want to ruin the plan. Uh, we went to dinner and at dinner I was nervous, and my sister was trying to talk to me. Uh, everybody was trying to calm me down. My daughter's mom tried to calm me down when she picked my daughter up before we went out. Everybody knew it was happening but her. I had a couple beers at the Bearcats game trying to calm my nerves, but also being careful because I didn't want to get drunk before it happened. Uh, I actually went live on Facebook, had people keeping her away from her phone. I wanted my brother and sister-in-law to watch it. They live out of town. So made sure she stayed off her phone. It was definitely freezing that night. So wanted to try to get it over with as soon as possible and get on with our night. But just seeing her reaction was worth every moment of it. I'm excited about spending forever with her, seeing what our kids are capable of, seeing how far they will go in life and how far they will succeed. And they're all very smart and can all accomplish great things as long as we help them throughout the way and teach them life. And I'm looking forward to basically just teaching our kids the way of the world as they get older. them up so I had plans for us to go to Bearcats game we were going to dinner before that um, after that we were going to access bowling alley on the levee and it was all supposed to be a surprise for him um, and I thought he didn't know anything about it so we came back home and it was funny because one of my daughters came up to me she they were already supposed to be in bed so she came up to me and she like looked at my hand and then she looked at my face and I was like what like what she was like oh nothing and then walked away walked over to him whispered something in his ear and he was like no you can't have any ice cream it's 10 o'clock it's past your bedtime and I'm like what's really going on here boss walks up to me and she's like she hands me my jacket and she says we're gonna go get a group picture outside uh, in front of the city skyline I want to get a picture of you and Robbie first so we go over there and we're standing there I'm like time's flying by it I feel like it's been like 30 minutes and we're just standing there and everybody's taking 
pictures. Well, I thought it was a picture. I guess it was all video. <laughs> he says, he's like, I just want you to know I love you very much. You've made my birthday the best birthday I've ever had. <laughs> so I'm like, what's really going on here? So then he turns and looks at me and uh, gets down on his knee. And I said, I said something. I said, I know you're not, excuse my language. I said, I know you're not kidding around right now. I said, <laughs> I said, I'll, I'll kill you. <laughs> and then that's when he asked me and I didn't even like say anything. I just kind of like grabbed him up and just held him and everybody's screaming around us. And somebody, I don't know who said it, but somebody said, is that a yes? Oh, it was Megan. She was like, is that a yes? And I was like, I like stopped and I was like, yes. <laughs> so it was, it was awesome.